Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Ari and I'm back with another video. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. So let's just get straight into the video because I'm excited. Look at this hair. So as y'all can see by the title, we are talking about this $50 10 inch wig. I do wanna start with the fact that I did receive this wig from BB Bobby and I will consider this a sponsored video because I did not, of course, buy it myself, but I just don't believe in saying like, oh, um, this is amazing just because somebody sent me something like that's just not how I fly. So y'all gonna get the real honest truth from me today. So like I said, the company is VV Bobby. Hey. Okay, VV Bobby, they don't have hair in it, but that's what I would just say. So the company is VV Bobby and this is how their packaging comes. Maybe I should do a little, oop. So it is pink, purple, and black, which I think is literally so cute, so girly. And the packaging is actually not like, um, I know some of these hair companies do come in boxes, but I like that it's not like that black or like all pink look. So that was cute to me. And then the also, the also, also the hair came with, of course, these two standard wig caps that come two pack and, um, the wig. Okay. So like I said, the wig is literally just $50. So I don't have to keep saying that because y'all already know what that means. Like this, this look for $50, like you can, I just feel like you can't beat that. Like. Everybody needs a wig or something that you could just throw on your head and be like, this is my hairstyle for the day. And it's like something quick. Literally, my mom braided four little braids because I cannot braid. And I also didn't know I could apply a wig. So I was freaking out. But look how this came out. Like, it's literally so quick, so easy. So speaking of so quick and so easy, let's go on to the quality. I don't know what segue I was trying to do right there, but that was my segue. Um, I would say the hair is literally... Like, I don't want to milk it saying like it's 10 out of 10, but I actually do think that the hair is 10 out of 10 for the simple fact that literally when I got it out of the box, my best friend only, um, she was over here when I opened it. And of course, who wouldn't open it with your friend? So all she did was pass my flat iron through it, which is nothing special. It's just, oh, let me open it. It's just these little flat irons from, um, Remington. I got like from Walmart a couple years ago. So it's nothing crazy and it just easily passed through. It's so light and so breathable. It has one of those caps that like when you hold it up to light, you can see straight through it. So it's nothing that's just like, oh my gosh, I need to get this off, which I literally love so much because I'm just not really a wig person. I would not consider myself someone that's like, oh, my next hairstyle is going to be a wig. So it's even crazy that I have this on right now and that I love it so much. So the next thing I want to talk about is the quality of the closure because just because the hair is good doesn't mean the, the closure is always going to be good. But I was actually very surprised being that this is a $50 wig. The closure, it looks so good. Like it's giving real tees and you guys can see that. So I would say that it's very much beginner friendly because like, I don't, did I mention this? I only have one wig and I, that just wasn't constructed by me and I needed it for my pro when I was in college, which was a year ago. So I have no real experience with this. So um, I plucked it. It didn't come with a, um, with a part already in. So it came like, like this is where the part is going to be, but I feel like it did definitely need my customiza customization skills. Well, I won't say skills because it just came out good, <laughs> but it did need me to go in and go ahead and pl uh, pluck a part for this and lay down the um, flyaways. So that's one thing. Also, I will mention that this wig did have a lot of those, um, the little sticking up flyaways that I would call them flyaways on my real hair. So they were flyaways on a wig to me. <laughs> So they had those, but it took nothing but some, um, I told you, I took, I used this Lotta Body, um, foam thing, my wand curler and, um, some, what is this? Some olive oil edge control because I don't have a wax stick because like I said, I don't, um, I don't use, I don't wear wigs like that. So the, I, the things that you would typically need, I don't really have, like I don't have a, um, the little comb thing. I don't have a hot comb. So I was using the wand curl and look how flat this is. Let me go like this. Literally, you can't tell me that that's not good quality <laughs> for $50, literally $50. So um, I just used a little bit of edge control, rub that on like a dime size amount, rub that on my palms and just straight one like that. And I guess everybody does that. I don't know, but that's just how I did it. The wig came with a, um, what is it called? An adjustable band. So it had an adjustable band, adjustable band, um, not adjustable. What is that? 
the stretchy thing. It had the stretchy band that um, goes from here to here. And I guess you clip it onto the back of your head. But the back of my head is actually really flat. So I actually did end up cutting that out because all it, would do, all it was doing was slipping the wig up. And that wasn't really working for me because it wouldn't have come out so flat and so cute like this. So I did end up cutting that out. But if that's something that you literally look for to be in your wigs, look no further because this wig had one. But I do say if you're not... Um, really into the adjustable band or whatever the thing is called. Um, the wig actually came with the clips. So it's like an adjust, that one's an adjustable band. So you can take it out and then adjust it. And I have it on the smallest setting. So it is small head friendly. My face is big, but the back of my head, I don't even know if y'all can see, but it's a slope. Okay, okay. So if you guys aren't big head, big head in the back, like a lump, this is a good wig for you. You'll be okay. You don't need, um, it doesn't ask for sizing, so don't be scared when you go to buy it and be like, oh my gosh, am I not fit? Because this actually fit. It also came with a clip here, 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 and in the back right here. So they're all clipped in. Um, they're all clipped in, and I had to just slip them under my uh, under my little braids that I have back there. There aren't even real braids, so if you're scared that it's not going to stay on your head, it is on my head. Look. Look at it. Look at it. So... All right, baby, don't pull too much. Don't pull too much. <laughs> so that this wig was um, sent to me, I have Amazon Prime, so I didn't have to wait. Like, I, I had, basically, the, the order came through Amazon Prime. And you know Amazon Prime is two days, so literally, you order your hair on Monday, you get your hair on Wednesday. You know, like, the turnaround time is so quick. If you need this for a little event or anything, you don't have to wait the full week or two weeks or whatever you have to wait for other hair companies. And that's one thing that I really enjoy about this because who wouldn't want hair at the drop of a dime? Literally. So, I do recommend if you're looking for fast hair, this is it. Um. Oh, also, one thing I meant to say is I, I think I said that I didn't do anything um, to the hair out of the package, but I will add that I also did not wash this, co-wash this or anything. I just felt like the way it came was just too perfect for me to like put water on and throw my products on it before, um, you know, I showed you guys the real true quality of it out of the box. So yes, this is straight out the box. This is what the hair will look like straight out the box. Y'all see that shine? The, well, up there is the only place I got some product. Over here, straight out the box, okay? So, um, the next thing I want to talk about is the, oh, I already talked about the construction. So the next thing I want to talk about is installing it. Um, when you install this hair, be mindful that the lace, um, okay. So when I, I think I have a picture of me wearing it, so I'll interest, I'll probably insert a clip of me like wearing it with the lace on it. So I just wanted to show you guys, um, what it looked like. It was, it was kind of a transparent moment but also it had like a little white undertone to it and I was kind of scared because I didn't know if my skin tone like um would be okay with that especially since like right here I have contoured all on my face so like when you go to do your makeup you want everything to be flawless especially if there's gonna be makeup on your head so one thing I will say is that when you put the makeup on the um on the actual lace to go ahead and blend that out or like make it blend to your skin, it's gonna be very successful, even though the lace does have like a white um, a white tone to it. So when I insert the clip, you guys will be able to see that, um, what I'm talking about between it being colored with my uh, foundation versus it being straight out the box. So don't be scared if you do go ahead and get this wig, don't be scared like, oh my gosh, it's not gonna work. Okay, so I do wanna end this with my final review, like just in case you guys were confused on what I was saying. I think this wig is very much, uh, Beginner. beginner friendly like myself I told you guys I have no experience with putting this on I feel like it was literally I won't say it was a breeze that would be a lie but I will say that it was very possible as you can see it's on my head the video that of me recording trying to put this on was a joke so it just turned into like an actual formal review and I feel like it came out perfect so if you're looking for something that's cost efficient if you're looking for something that's amazing quality if you're looking for something that's going to come to your door literally in two days if you're looking for something that you can just try with this would be the wig for you and i don't i like i said in the beginning of this video i do not believe that just because something is sent to you or just because um you know someone's looking for a positive review does not mean you have to give one but i do believe that this is something that deserves a good review um i had an amazing experience with speaking with the company as well i give them a five out of five for um 
for even like conversing with me or telling me like, hey, this is what we look like. So um, yeah, if you're interested, like I said, the links, everything will be down there in the bio. Um, in my bio, what am I? Everything that you need to know about this hair will be located down in the description box um, from the exact wig that I have, from the Instagram, from their email. I believe everything is down there. If you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and leave a comment down below. I'll see you guys in my next video.